Yep, 80. Beautiful. Seventy-five fan out. Oof. <laughs> Do you have to go back to work now? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do, yeah. Okay. Everyone in New Zealand has a chance to be a New Zealand champion. Uh, that's for sure. So you're talking anyone in that uh, top 10, top 20, has a chance. That, I believe. Is it one word or is it two words? Oh, good question. <laughs> Maybe I'll make it. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the ways I, I learn. It's just through playing games and being social. Yeah. Roger, would you like to put the oven on? I've got to take the chicken out of the fridge. <laughs> Please? Yeah, yeah, sure. Well, fan bag. Helpful. Hold. Hold, challenge that. All right, you can hit it. <laughs> Dang. Well done. Welcome to Dylan's Scrabble Wall of Fame. When I played the Cape Town International in 2016. I got 727, one of the top 10 game scores in the world. And uh, a couple of years later, I went on to beat that in New Zealand, 756. This mug I got from the New Zealand Masters in Tauranga in 2020, when I was lucky enough to win uh, the first and only time. And that brings me to the next topic um, that Stanley likes to tease me about. This beautiful trophy is uh, for second place in the New Zealand Masters, which I have now been quite unquote fortunate enough to win three times and is starting to earn me a nickname of the bridesmaid. Thanks, Stanley. This is the 2018 New Zealand Nationals trophy. I was lucky enough to win that one and hoping to repeat uh, this year's national championships. Oh, hi, James, it's Laura calling you back. Hey, how are you? No, I was just ringing because my house is being demolished. Um, yeah, I have to get my house taken down quite quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, it's, a, it's a tough journey. I certainly had my moments <laughs> of <laughs> distress on that journey, but yeah. It's, uh, its foundations weren't repaired properly after the earthquakes, so it's going to be knocked down. It's been really stressful. Everything has come together at the same time. So there's the nationals, buying a house, having a house demolished, moving to temporary accommodation. The tournament just two weeks ago as well in, in Christchurch. I wasn't necessarily going to do nationals, but I knew it was coming up and <laughs> I've never played in the nationals before. So I figured I'd find a way to make it work. I shouldn't. Yeah, well, um, I failed. <laughs> I dropped the ball and I slipped from the A grades to the B grade in the Nationals. I'm now under a bit of pressure because I've got more to lose than I have to gain. There's a gamut of solid B graders who have beaten me many times. <laughs> and historically, I don't actually play well in the Nationals. So this is another added challenge, which I'm looking forward to because that must change eventually. Yeah, when I'm in meetings, I, I keep up with the word study because, you know, sometimes you sit for a long time in a meeting without much to say or no action items or strafed, I think. Yep. It's difficult to keep the motivation levels high and study consistently every day. But if you really want to get good, you need to spend at least an hour or two per day. And even then, it might not be enough. If you want to get anywhere in Scrabble World Rankings, you basically need to know the words immediately upon first sight. Oh, it's not really sure, is it? No. 
Oh yeah, Erasure. And Guarani, which is uh, some mandatory units of Paraguay. So I have an 11 year old boy, his name's Micah, and uh, I have shared custody with his dad. We have week about care of him. I don't know if you know, but Saya, who's goated at chess, like insane, mm -hmm. and I beat him today. Did you? Uh huh. Wow. How did you beat him? Mm, big brain. <laughs> And I got three vowels. That sounds pretty good. Six, I'm six, just going to do the ace because I can't think of anything else. Ace. Nice. Alrighty. Your turn. I played hay. Mm, mm, Here we mm, go. Mm. <laughs> Didn't last long. Okay, what's your word? Tavgjidum. Alright. Iborium. What does that mean? A place where you go to be very, very bored. Oh, look how many points I'm going to get for this. Ittle nads, big massive nits. A big massive nit is an ittle nad. Uh -huh. Right, I'm throwing a, a real word into the mix. Favor. Who does some chess now? Please, please. Indicia. I N D I C I A takes two N hooks. N S L and S. A nana. A N A N A takes an S for who? <laughs> S O R takes an S. Anagram located. Serrated. C E R A T E D. I'm amazed at how many I forget. I, and I don't mind writing down um, um, literally almost everything. Sometimes I'm. Um, Geotag. Can't believe I missed that. Nothing wrong with a bit of uh, self-flagellation. When I first got into Scrabble, I, I went through a phase where I studied for about three hours a day. <laughs> I was just in love with learning the words. Like, you know, this is a year. It took me a year to learn the threes. And I would come up with, here we go. This is the E threes. And I would make a story using all of the three letter words. So I've got the long E's of many L's were full of O to the delight of a uh, Ute ready to ean. <laughs> Her baby effed. <laughs> that actually means something if you know what all those words mean. Anyway, it goes on and on. <laughs> I'm gonna write a kid's book of Scrabble words. Uh, yeah, at the moment I study for about 15 minutes a day. I really want Scrabble in my life, but I don't want it to be the only thing in my life. Yeah, <laughs> gotta, gotta curb the addiction. What I've noticed is that people who enjoy playing Scrabble get a little bit of a thrill out of solving an anagram, like a dopamine rush, or there's just a small thrill every time a bunch of letters clicks into place. Tip off. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's, no. it's tit for. <laughs> and the other thing that um, Dylan and I have noted over the course of a weekend when you're playing in a tournament, everything is forgotten because you're so in the zone. Soon as the tournament's over, oh, that's right, my life's shit again. <laughs> this Nationals, I think it's a very strong field. Dylan is always a, a major threat. Blue, Joanne, Andrew, who's just won his... the nemesis of mine. Andrew, oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, really? yeah. I can't beat Blue. Okay. <laughs> Flotels. Trigram, Frib, Clart, Unbreak, Skrull, Exonumia, Alapa, Urubus, Meanies, Jolliff, Foodwa, Basca, Xeroth, Yashmak, Libraire, Satripetal, Pioi, Nostrum, Opopenex, Snicket, Fustig, the strength of the field and you've got one of the top women in the world for your first game and if I can find a pen. Kia ora Koza. welcome to the 43rd National Championship. 
and nationals, they've had people like Lennis. Money's on you. Okay, we have two games running on, and then we'll have morning tea upstairs. So enjoy your games. <laughs> Seventy-two. Very nice. Thank you. So, yes, six and five. Very good. Mm. <laughs> I wouldn't pull fast enough either, uh, Buggy. Wouldn't you? <laughs> Four seventy four. Nice. It's probably the winning play right here. I'm not liking this. Not going to make it difficult for you. Six, thirty-seven. Mm. 28, 29, 30. That'll give you the game. Well done. Well done. <laughs> Four. I'm going to pass. I'll pass as well. Pass two. Do I stop it? Yeah. Eight, Three, eight, six. six. Well done, yeah. Oh, that was such a tough game. Oh. oh, look, your first win. <laughs> well played. Until we meet again. Oh, it's absolutely slaughtered. That's a rough start. I felt like I was just surviving that whole game. One down, 21 to go. <laughs> Why do we do this? Oh, <laughs> Butterflies is good, alewives yeah, yeah, is good. Subtler is nice. Yeah, not good enough. <laughs> 89. There's no more lettuce in the bag. Oh, is that right? Yes. That wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> Blue. Here we go. Oh, you want to shake them on the floor? Yeah, yeah, have a good one. Seventy seven. Beautiful. I knew that was trouble. T. <laughs> I think it's right. It is right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eighty-one, hundred thirty-one. Very good. No, lucky. Challenge both. Just break, yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> Brilliant. Who's that? 
So you make it 335. I'll make it 314 to 335. You heard 328? <laughs> right, 338. Oh, 338, you did. I didn't have a hope, Sam, did I? Well, yeah, Nostrum just fell in love with you, didn't I? <laughs> got you again. He got me again. He played like a genius. 100 points, 100 points. Keep you on the rebound there. Yep. Well done, Lynn. Oh, what a great game. <laughs> it was. Oh, that's been my favourite game so far. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Good luck against your games. How are you doing? Nah, 50%. Oh, yeah. You? Two. Two wins. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good. Uh, but you're still chipper? No. <laughs> oh, okay. No, I'm a bit deflated now, I would say. Yeah? Hey, Laura. Hello. I'm okay. um, doing pretty good, actually. Oh, excellent. Yeah, I've had some good games. I had a couple of 500s, so, <gasps> yeah. I'm going to take lessons from you. <laughs> you get the 500. Let's see. Quangos, of course, was the biggest mistake of the day. Quangos within a year, wasn't it? Yeah, there's no excuse for that at this level. How was your day? Uh, yep, I won all my eight games today. One against Joe was my second turn, I played Astride, 71. Next turn, I played Cap-like for 101. Oh, then I'm just catching up with you, yeah. Jo finally got a bingo. She played Riffing. What's the anagram of Riffing? Um, Griffin. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Gee, she could have played that, you know. My favourite player was Heronry. Exuvia was probably a really good one because I had... What goes on the end of Exuvia? E and L. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I hope you didn't hear me swearing today because I was um, cursing once or twice. So, um... Yeah, you work cut out for you. No! Oh no! Hiatus was really nice. We're turning a corner. Fifteen, sixteen, sixty-six. Oh, there goes that small hope I had. Unusual that you didn't manage to get a, a bonus. I was nowhere near it. Could be my end of my corner. Seventy six. Yeah, we're taking a chance. <laughs> Well played. That's very tough. Very, very tough. Eighty-two. Very nice. Uh, oh, what? It's not right. Why do I think I could do that? You goodness me. 17. Hold. Oh, how's it? How's it? How's it? Yep, I'll challenge it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was an amazing game. Well done. Well done. Well played. Really well played. Well, what does a person feel after being brutalised by your friends over two days? <laughs> I came in today thinking that I had a very slim outside chance. 
But after today's dismal performance, uh, that's obviously now no longer possible. These things happen, I guess, in Scrabble. My son made this for me in school. He gave it to me for my Mother's Day present. It's my good luck charm. Today I won five games and lost four. I think the tiredness is probably a bit of a factor. Is it, does this give me like a more formidable presence? <laughs> I uh, got here today and I was actually nervous and I haven't been nervous for such a long time. I had to sort of uh, tighten up and, uh, and be mean. It's about, yeah, closing it out now. It's time to perform. Ah, oh, you idiot, Lawson. <laughs> No, Damn. Damn. Peter 30 for 3 for 45, 38, 88. Well done. Nice spot. Sorry. 68. Seven and two. Oh, Jake. Unbelievable. <laughs> I've got this game completely won and I lose it. <laughs> and you had your score wrong as well, which helped. So you were miles behind. <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, that Scrabble man. <laughs> <laughs> that was super entertaining. Wow. Apparently I am his nemesis and he can't get me out of his head. Well, yeah, if I lose the next game and Chris wins the next game, then we're tied on games. So, yeah, it, it does come down to this last game. But, the, you know, it gets in your head, like, when you think, oh, sh I could win easy against her, and then, you, and then you make silly mistakes. And, you know, you can lose against anyone, really. Thirty-five. Very good. Very good. Seventy-one is for Sammy. Oh. I've got eight. Sorry. <clears throat> oh, you look at them both and then you choose which oh, one to put back. Yeah. Thank you. Three oh seven. Just, just, just in case you didn't know how to spell it, I thought I'd say it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's an N. Seven and two. Seven and two. Okay. I'd only play it if I thought it was okay. Yes, it is. That's a good score. Yes. That's my best word score in the tournament. I killed this man. <laughs> no, it's my best friend. Right, prize giving, the most exciting part of the weekend. Okay, now we come to A grade. 
So Lyris is the winner with 18 wins, and Lyris hasn't played in a tournament probably for nearly two years. And first in B grade with 18 wins after not a great start was Lawson from Mount Albert. <laughs> Take your time. <laughs> Come on, Lawson. Mega star. <laughs> now, C grade is somebody playing their very first nationals, and that is Laura from Christchurch. <laughs> now, Laura had 15 wins, but wait, she had 42 bonus words. <laughs> Beautiful. That is stunning. And we've got one more trophy. We give the Georgie trophy to the person who's gained the most rating points. Just about every other nationals that's gone to somebody in E grade has done really, really well. But this time, the person who won it is Laura. Woo! <laughs> Laura has gained 149 rating points. Oh, massive. So, you guys in A grade, you better watch out. I better not cry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to make sure. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Excellent, good. thank you. Thanks for your support. Oh, well done. Fantastic. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you next year at oh, the um, yeah. Nationals in the B grade, if not the A grade. That's truly amazing. She's won yeah. Nationals. Yeah. One yeah. winner, oh, yeah. Andrew, by the way. Yeah. Hi, Andrew. Andrew. Well done. Great to meet yeah. you. Thank you. Well you done, you. Thank you. Well Thanks, you. Blue. Wow. Yeah. Maybe I'll get to play Impressive. you one day. Hey, Laura. Hey, Tim. How's it going? Good. Good. Hey, um, yeah. is Micah handy? Yeah, yes. Mum's on the phone. Hello, Mama. Hey. I won my grade at the Scrabble tournament. Wow. wow. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, thank you. It's really fun to feel good at something. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Micah, I brought your hat with me for good luck. You know the hat you gave me for Mother's Day? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, so thank you. It brought me all the luck I needed. <laughs> You caught him in the middle of a star blast game. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your video games, hon. Yeah.